In 2018, Australian artist Stephen Copland was invited by the Albertina Academy of Fine Arts Turin, Italy, to conduct the artist book workshop, Landscape of Heritage. The workshop investigates how the artist's book has the potential to function as an alternative space to celebrate migration, heritage and diversity. series of three, which is uh, incomplete because I have to finish this. There will be something like this and photography, some photography, some out of here. Um, so this is the first, the second and the third. And um, I start exploring my body, which is a research that I do uh, on photography first because I do photography in my life. And I never do something like this, so it's a new thing. So I choose some photos that are the wrong photo photos that I made. So they are not the they are the bad photo. Okay, so I'm not going to use them. So I try to give them a new sense using them in this way and um, destroy them. So this is so it is and. Um, I use plastic in the, the three books are very similar because they are connected um, to the other so and I always use plastic because it is a very fake material mm. that is in contrast with the body which is something I think I imagine that body is something hot and warm while the plastic is something cold and uh, not warm. <laughs> And I use color because I like color because of, uh, uh, the life uh, is hard, but it's also beautiful, like color. And the color is feeling, it is beautiful. No? And uh, I use this uh, material, metal, because uh, it's very strong in the, in the life. Mm -hmm. I like uh, to match. Uh, this is rame, I don't know in English the name of this. Eh? What's the name? Yeah, okay. And uh, it's a uh, metallo di venere, you know, and uh, it's a uh, love. Mm. The il rame è il trasmettitore della del, dell'amore secondo mm. l'esoterismo, no? Quindi, siccome io uh, uh, this is transparent because I think that uh, the life is material. Noi siamo nella vita materiale, però abbiamo una parte spirituale di ricerca and uh, io, come diceva lei, uh, più o meno filo buddista, siamo incarnati we say this life if we choose the family, we choose the friends, we choose um, a part of my of my work in uh, in the card is abstract what and uh, also in uh, this is uh, my little uh, drawing and uh, I can also try to um, this, in this uh, work uh, put all um, other typology of materials and all, um, the, the line the liner and uh, like a connection with the opposite parts of uh, of the south, of the world, of the... It seems to be a house. Oh, yes, yeah, a, a construction of... Uh, is a metaphor, uh, okay. symbolic, uh, with the interior uh, construction yes. and uh, elaboration uh, of the, <laughs> of yeah. the life. Yeah. Yeah. Also the, the past, the, 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 the remember, uh, but also the, the mystery of the, <laughs> the life. The universe, the and the, the, the my my experience in this world, <laughs> and uh, this is uh, another um, mm, experiment <laughs> experiment. But uh, um, I, I I can uh, also. Um, mm, see. 
uh, in the in the future I can uh, uh, we we elaboration and uh, so this is an idea that uh, is uh, uh, good for me. It's very interesting uh, this uh, uh, typology of uh, working the two dimensional because I work. Uh, um, uh, always in a, in a in a big dimension. Yeah. Well, what I, I can see is you mentioned complexity, and also I think also it's courageous, you know, because the journey here is from working with I think quite wonderful, yeah, you know, like they're wonderful works. You'll that he's, you'll make yeah, they're wonderful uh, prints and imaginative and, yeah. and, and, and their journeys in themselves. Mm -hmm. So to go from the flat, what you're doing, what you're doing actually here is actually, I mean, it's the potential of this to end up as a, uh, almost like a, um, um, a construction that, that, that uh, describes almost what these are like very internal, like internal mind. So it's, mm -hmm. it's the workings of a mind. The mind? That, yeah, that, that's very um, complex. Yeah. So, so it, it's actually... Also the, the windows. Uh, yeah. Uh, tough of the windows yeah. in composite. Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely. And, and I, I would just recommend one thing, is um, have a... Uh, Put the lights off. Put a light. Mm -hmm. I put a light on this. Ah, yeah. And then um, draw it. E poi scrivici. Draw it like you draw. Con i tuoi tipi di disegni, no? Your drawings are just like uh, beautiful. This is very beautiful. They're, they're beautiful because I very like a lot in it. I think the whole art and the photo like the family's history, uh, but now my grand uh, grandfather is dead, but in my eyes, uh, he never lived because uh, he and never in this photo. Oh, okay. yeah, that's all. Wonderful. I, I love them because I, I think that, I mean, it's, um, you can see that. Uh, the, I think he's in the integration of the, the collage is exactly what I talked about is the idea of that it's a photocopy, it's cheap, it, you run it through a mechanical and then it becomes something that less than a mechanical and of course you have the positive, like a positive, and you have the negative which is the, the, re, the, the shadow of the real thing. Very dove il bambino è figlio del mondo, figlio del mondo che è sostanzialmente legato, Opla. guardate qui si sono staccati, ma tutto è stato fatto molto velocemente, sono legati a un non tempo perché questa eh, struttura che non ha una, una dimensione di passato e futuro ma rimane su uno stesso piano eh, determina l'impossibilità praticamente mentale di riuscire eh, ad andare avanti eh, sempre nel tempo cioè quindi questo tempo sempre costantemente presente dalla nascita alla morte fino all'identità rimane su uno stesso piano l'identificazione è legata a questa eh, tela, questa rete che blocca la possibilità di vedere esattamente la realtà della nostra vita quindi le immagini che sono all'interno di questo scompartimento quasi non si possono vedere, cioè si possono solo immaginare. Quindi possiamo immaginare un uomo, possiamo immaginare una donna, possiamo immaginare... Um, the journey here is, I found interesting, because um, I understand it was a big uh, sort of struggle. But the, 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 in the first day, the second day, when you came back with, with your idea, your co construction, the concept of the construction, and then the symbols, and I think to get to where you are now, this is fantastic. So, <laughs>
when they were more particular, when I was a um, child, child uh, baby, and I don't want to talk about it. And I so, my dream, my dream uh, was um, in Lupo, in Trasca, in the Italiano inglese. My, uh, my book life, or oh, my book's life. Uh, praticamente mi è venuta questa idea di mettere la mia uh, mia immag uh, immagine uh, che avevo qua tre anni. E poi con mia zia, perché noi sempre eravamo insieme, siamo cresciuti insieme, quindi, però ho tolto perché non stava. Poi ho scritto eh, quella frase che io ogni tanto scrivo qualcosa e mettendo in questi, però, però ho messo contrario, nel senso così non si legge, però avanti un specchio si legge. Però poi come segreto che non volevo si legge. Mm -hmm. e quindi poi ho lavorato queste mh, cose piccole che sono ricordi di quando ero bambina che giocavo magari eh, un ricordo di mare mm -hmm. che con mia zia e con miei sempre eravamo al mare mm -hmm. e poi ho lavorato come un eh, codice nel senso mh, non è bisogno sempre che 
si apre un libro e si legge e capire cosa ha scritto dentro. Con vedere di un foto si può capire, cioè non tutto, però si può capire, prendere sentimentalmente. Words and images that use our personal background seek to broaden the capacities of communities to facilitate personal engagement with the migrant experience. The workshop creates the possibility for diversion thinking and demonstrates how an authentic and creative response to an individual heritage and identity can be a catalyst to the making of a series of interdisciplinary objects. In this regard, making personal objects that refer to history and identity of the world community will foster a capacity or pattern of connectedness within the community rather than difference. The ritual of creative effort may assist in coming to terms with loss, learning tolerance and seeing shared commonalities. The workshop demonstrates that creativity can be awakened by a personal relationship with the content, a content called heritage, where the past and the present merge to create a sense of community in the global village. <laughs>